So Aiden Ross has officially been banned on Twitch and he is currently streaming on Kick to talk about what happened. Now, he did say early on in the stream that he can't talk about the specifics because his uh, lawyer team told him not to. But what he can say, it has a lot to do with the fact that he just refuses to fit into this mold that Twitch wants him to be in. As we all know, this is something that Andrew Tate also talked about as well. Um, it seems that when your views are a lot different than what Twitch wants you to push out, they, they typically tend to try to silence you. Um, he basically talks about how a lot of the streamers, a lot of Twitch's favorite streamers all do pandering and basically a lot of ass kissing. And this is why they're able to uh, continuously grow within the company or grow as a streamer. But the people that, you know, basically go against the grain usually gets uh, silenced or pushed out a la uh, Bruce drop them off. Obviously, we know I show speed got kicked off the app and now Aiden. Um, I don't necessarily know if it's exactly a silencing thing, but I definitely agree with this premise that because he doesn't fit the typical um, content safe uh, streamer brand safe streamer i definitely think that they want to phase him out because he's just too large of a streamer you know he he has a huge following of people and i think the best way to kind of sum up why to, or what's going on with him and twitch is basically there's two people right there's two people who are trying to go for a job you have the clean cut guy no tattoos uh low cut never been in trouble and then you got the one guy over here who's also never been in trouble but because he has locks or tattoos or stuff they'll just pick this guy because this guy kind of looks more of the brand you know is more on brand with what the company wants him to push so as you can see too you also will notice that streamers don't, that don't that rarely cuss or don't cuss as much usually get pushed up as well so it's all a game it's all basically a lot of pandering a lot of jumping through hoops and Aiden Ross basically said I'm tired of doing that I want to be myself on stream I don't want to fake being who I am and that's basically his issue with Twitch and which is why he went to kick in the first place he wants to be authentically himself and these companies are basically make these guys be watered down version of themselves because every little thing that they do gets them suspended or they get some type of strike against their channel so there's that I want to know what you guys think down below I know it's a little bit vague I know it's a lot going on with his situation but that's pretty much sums up why he's banned on Twitch